Okay, let's draw this model on the right. New part. Select from the front plane. Sketch. Draw a center line. About 16 mm. Escape. Okay, draw a circle. Dimension radius four, so diameter is eight. Draw circle. Dimension radius eight, so diameter is sixteen. Okay, let's draw a perimeter circle. Make sure the cursor is on the upper on the upper side of the circle. Click and on the lower side of the circle. Click, right click, and give a radius of eighteen. So let's trim. Use power trim. Click drag. Let's mirror this up over to the other side. Click. Click the mirror entity. Click. Entity to mirror, select this up. Make a copy of it. Mirror about, select this line. Click. Let's trim again. Power trim. Click, drag. Click, drag. Click, drag. Click, drag across. Okay, let's dimension this up. Again, 18. Okay. Let's delete this. This dimension. Press delete. Select. Press delete. So we dimension this as a radius of 4. Okay. Click this. Delete. Okay, we can dimension this one as a radius of 8. This distance. Supposed to be sixteen. So the sketch is fully defined. We'll go in the stroke feature, extrude ball space. So we are going to extrude about the mid plane, ten mm, and a draft angle of six degree. So select mid plane, 10 mm, a drop of 6 degree. Okay. Okay, we have completed the body. Next, on the right plane, we are going to create a slot. Click right, sketch, number 2. Let's draw the 
sketch outside click click ok draw a dungeon up click click draw a center line the distance is 20 the wave is 7 ok you can extend entity click extend I want to extend this one up Now we draw a center line on the on the body. Escape. So let's move this sketch into the body. Add dimension, add, add relation. Right click on this line. Select midpoint. Right click on this line. Select midpoint. Okay, give a coincident relationship. Okay, the sketch is fully defined. Let's do a extra cut. Okay mid plane ok make 20 mm ok cut through the body ok now we are going to draw, the, draw a circle above so let's create a sketch on the right plane click right Click the right sketch. Normal two. Let's draw a circle. Escape. We are drawing a center circle, not a perimeter circle. Ok, add a relation Make the arc and the origin Escape Add relation, make the center point and origin Vertical Dimension the circle mm dimension the the center to the origin twenty four the sketch is fully defined let's extrude mid plane again four mm with a draft of six degree feature <coughs> extrude board base turn to isometric select mid plane distance of 4 mm drop angle 6 a 4 mm Click, click the drop angle and select make 6 degree click ok next we are going to draw a circle on this space here select this space sketch 
namatu start sakta stay on the edge for a while to wake up the center the center point appear click the center point here dimension 5 mm Let's go to feature manager, uh, go to the extra board, boss base, isometric view, <coughs> change direction, true all. I beg pardon, I make a mistake, it should be a stroke cut. So, we can delete the the feature click and press delete yes so select the sketch go to feature feature tab select extra cut draw So now we are going to create another hole on, on this space here. Click, sketch, number two, draw a circle. Dimension the circle, 3mm. So dimension the center to the origin 6mm Ok, at the relation The center of the circle and the origin so must be vertical And the sketch is fully defined Feature tab Extra cut Okay, now we give a 2 mm and a half mm fillet to, to the model. Fillet 1 mm. Select this edge, this edge, this edge, this edge. This edge. Okay. We look one more time. Point five. Create the hole. H. The other side. Okay. Isometric view. So we have completed the model. Thanks for watching the video.